Mom, you want to ride them? Welcome back to my channel. I have my Christmas sweater on. We are gonna do a clean and decorate with me. And the girls are taking a nap right now, so I just took a second to pick up all the toys in the living room. However, this is the first year we have like a couch room, a sectional, a huge one in here in the living room. So I'm gonna have to remove a portion for us to actually be able to fit our Christmas tree in the living room where I want it. So you're gonna see me rearrange, clean, and then when the girls wake up, we will decorate. I'm really excited um, because this is just phase one of our decorating. This is like all the decorations we've had in the past. We've had this tree for like six years. I love it. Um, this is the first year I went out to the garage and since we had early snow, uh, it melted in the garage and the box is wet. So I am going to have to buy a tote after Christmas this year. I've had the same box, it's torn. So that's gonna go in the trash after um, I put up the Christmas tree. I am going to take the girls to the store in about a week or two and let them pick out their own ornament. That's our like holiday tradition. Each year they have an ornament and they get to put that one up on the tree. And then we usually buy like one or two more decorations. So over the years, I've just kind of kept adding on to our collection for uh, Christmas. Okay, I think I put on a sweat trying to move the couch around and connect those pieces together. I don't know how many times I tried it, but we got it done. Okay, it's now time to bring in all these boxes. I think I have two totes for Christmas and then you're gonna see me bring in the pieces of the Christmas tree with no box because it's got what? <laughs> okay, it's all here now. Let's get decorating. Anyone else have to have their slippers on in the house at all times? Anyway. Here's the spot. We're gonna rearrange. No more Halloween. Okay, I'm hoping it fits in this corner. I know that it's pretty big. The girls are waking up because I can hear my older daughter, so they're gonna love this. She's slowly waking up. I think it's okay if it hits this a little bit because I'm gonna try to do Christmas decor on it anyway, and it's touching the wall, but I think that's okay. We don't keep our tree on very long. Um, just turn it on at night and it looks so pretty. I cannot wait to turn it on. And the one sad part, little story time, 
is I actually love real Christmas trees. I think they're so pretty. They smell so good. The first year I moved out here, I was <laughs> insistent that we had one. So Corey and I went, I picked out this cute little tree in negative 27 degree weather. Um, within the first two seconds, I found the first one I saw, said, yep, I'll take it. And the guy said, do you want me to take it apart so you can see how it looks? You know, like cut down the plastic that holds it together. I said, nope, just throw it in the car, I'll take it. We get home, um, it's like a Charlie Brown tree. Okay, it was like a cactus, it was so pokey to put on. And of course, that was my first year getting to decorate my own place. And so I was like, oh, we must have this these glitter ornaments and everything. We lived in glitter for the next year. So, Never again will I do glitter ornaments because I do not like glitter everywhere after. Let me know how you feel about glitter. I love it, just not on me every day. And so just a tip for you guys, always choose a location close to a plug if you have um, a Christmas tree that you're putting up so that you can plug it in. I actually think it's gonna fit in this corner. Wait a minute. Uh, try number two that was the top here's the middle that's real life for you so the one thing is is our place doesn't have a fireplace so I always choose a spot to hang our stocking so this year we'll see where i choose to put them like i said our living room is completely different now that we have a sectional so i'm trying to get creative you guys are going to just see trial and error with me um where things work person who's afraid to, to plug in the Christmas tree uh, after it's been storing for a year because if it doesn't turn on I can't even imagine uh, what I would do hey what do you see This is Anovale's first Christmas ornament. Here's Tally Rose's first ornament for her first year. This is Tally Rose's second year ornament. My story about our first year Christmas tree. This is the stump.
These are my favorite when you have a custom one. This is one of my absolute favorite uh, decorations that we have. We put the days till Christmas and then we actually do something fun with this little mailbox for the girls. And then we got all the decorations on our Christmas tree. Mom, you can ask me. Mommy, you can ask me. Are you one of the decorations? <laughs> we top our Christmas tree with a bow. Yes, what do you guys bow. top your Christmas tree with? And then I absolutely love Mommy, look at me. our Santa I look. over here in the corner and our reindeer. Fun fact, right behind Kelly Rose's head, this is Rudolph. He was not Rudolph before. When I purchased Mommy. him, he had no nose, and I went and put this little red cotton ball on his nose. On, on the nose. second shelf here, I put something that I don't mind if the kids are playing with it. And then uh, Mommy, lower, I put all of these... You, um, stuffed animals that are just hanging from the bottom of the tree because we actually don't do gifts under the tree um, yeah. Santa brings the gifts so there's nothing until Christmas Okay, so I chose to hang the stockings this year on this arrow over on this other side of the blinds. Corey and I are going to enjoy hot chocolate and some cookies. But I thought I'd share with you, I moved um, over this side table to the other side so that the tree would just have more room. The kids are off in bed, so we're just gonna enjoy our hot chocolate and cookies. I just wanna say thank you guys so much for decorating and rearranging with me a little bit. This is honestly my favorite time of the year. Um, I absolutely love Christmas. So this is actually a part one out of part probably two of a decorate with me. The girls will still have to go get their um, tradition of getting a ornament and we will probably do some sort of Christmas craft and we still have the window cling stickers to do. And by the time the girls woke up and we got like the Christmas tree set up, it was already dark outside. So I'd rather do that when it's light. So we will do that for part two. I am really glad I get to just sit now and drink some hot chocolate because that took a lot of work. <laughs> you guys saw me sweating trying to move this couch part. Um, I'm sure I'll fast forward through it, but it took me way longer than needed. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see you in my next one. Bye. What's what, honey? Snowball. Rose. <laughs>